Good morning, my amazing people. Still working on the bus. Uh, one quick thing. I Strategy-wise, I've been trying to keep the videos together, and I know I've mentioned this before. Um, let me know if this, in terms of the build, searching for videos was helpful. I've tried to keep the jobs together. Otherwise, if I kept with the daily vlogs, it could... I mean, realistically, the floors took me just this part and under the steps took me four or five days. Um, just how I roll. This is my first time. <laughs> I've never done this before. I just learned from Ronnie, the flooring expert. Um, so in, in an effort to keep everything easy to find, easy to search, easy to watch and repeat, I've kept them together. You guys remember what I put on my last bus? Well, if your answer is a rooftop lawn, your answer is correct. I do have more AstroTurf, and for anybody who's wondering why I would cover up such a gorgeous deck, there is a special aspect to this rooftop lawn that has never been done before. And I've noticed that a lot of people online, you know, like to copy uh, ideas and things like that so just to let you know it's all right and by the way I too have copied and been inspired from people this whole layout is inspired by navigation nowhere uh, the um, the aesthetic the white with the dark has been inspired copied if you will from some of the tiny houses uh, with that very clean look I deviated from Mike's bus because I I didn't think it would be very fun to make a carbon copy of somebody else's work. Um, so I have a few different elements of things, of course, with my own fun touches like the roof and um, you know the solar-powered charging station, along with that borrowed, copied from Mike as well, and you know some other ideas. So it, you know, but I added some fun touches here, outside speakers and and you know some other things like that. So I'm trying to make it my own, you know. Uh, so. I don't really know what I'm doing today, but since I already mentioned the lawn, I might as well get started on my lawn. But first, it is time to put the ladder up. All right, meow. Before I put the grass on, I'm gonna install the ladder. Uh, got some uh, stainless stool, sta stainless stool. I hope my stools aren't stainless. Stainless steel bolts here, uh, three eighths, with some uh, lock nuts, nylon nuts for the back. Um, I have some stainless steel screws for these. I don't really think those are necessary, but that's, I'm just doing it. And then I'll be bolting into the top, uh, into the roof. Um, so that's what we're looking like right now. All right, we've reached a little question mark because <clears throat> it's gonna be a little hard to drill holes for the screws. The screws are gonna go in at an angle. Just a little concerned about that. An option would be, I could, now I know this would not be load bearing, but I could use JB Weld on the inside and just, and I know that would be adhering to the paint, but I feel like all the weight <clears throat> is supported by these four 3 8 bolts and I, these are extremely strong. The other anchor point would be the roof. There's no way, there's no way if someone was walking down it, it would tear out of two by sixes. Because there would be four bolts in the two by sixes. See what I'm saying? So I'm just kind of debating that right now. I'll let you know what I decide. And the survey says, I'm gonna use Fuse It. Uh, this is crazy strong. So I'm just gonna put it behind the mounting points and then just bolt it in from the roof and the bumper. All right, now with the ladder mostly installed, I am, guys, I'm on the roof. And, excuse the horns honking, we had some 15 year olds, 16 year olds, some, some guys. All right, so we have this synthetic grass. We have this Kentucky 60, it's nice, it's soft. Some people are gonna complain, oh, 
covering up nice red redwood deck. Yes, I am. Oh my gosh, what what is that? What's this flag for? Is this could it be? Could it be a rooftop putting green? <gasps> dun da 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 da. Guys, this is a big surprise. The last bus I had a rooftop lawn. I always wanted a wooden deck. But then I thought to myself, you know, if you sit down, it's not all that comfy. So I thought to myself, let's put grass again. I thought to myself, why not make it entertaining up here and put a rooftop putting green. This is the Jack's International Golf Course Resort and Spa. Also, I welded on a flagpole uh, holder right there. And I'll have a 17 foot, so it's going to be like 25 feet in the air. But I'm excited for this par 3. I haven't golfed in a long time. Actually, one of my first jobs, not one of my first jobs, but my first 1040? 1040? Is it 1040? I haven't had one of those in a long time. A paycheck job. Or I got a real paycheck, like from a paycheck company, was picking up golf balls. So, if anybody wants to challenge me, Tiger Woods, in case you're watching, bro, I challenge you to a putt off. Guys, it's really happening. I cut a hole in the roof, top deck. Uh, <clears throat> didn't uh, cut one in half because otherwise, uh, yeah, you know, it's almost the whole size of that wood there, so. Instead of creating a hazard, I, you know, that's not, that's not a hazard. That's still a, like a two by four. So anyways, that's where it's going, right in the corner. All right, just doing a little test fit here. My hole saw was, oh, I don't know, a quarter inch too small for this hole. So I ended up using a jigsaw and uh, boring it out a little. And uh, yeah, just kind of mocking it up here with how high the grass is gonna sit. Cause uh, yeah gonna be my lip here so I think that's gonna be okay and uh, let's cut around that hole all right here we go this is a mock-up just kind of unrolled it a bit this is a lot nicer than the uh, curved roof I had before which always uh, um, kind of dipped and cracked and made noise because of no spray foam insulation keeping it nice and rigid and I do not recommend walking on your spray foam because Eventually it'll crack, deteriorate. So, we have a eight, eight foot, this is eight feet, eight foot piece of grass. They just gave me the end of the roll cut. It was, I don't know, 30% off or something. We're just doing a little mock-up. We're gonna silicone it, and then to keep the ball from falling off, I'll put a trim piece of wood around the whole thing, like a two by two or something, or one by two, I don't know, something. Anyways, looks good, right? First. Uh, school bus to have a putting green on the roof. If I have no other claim to fame, I now have one. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the Jacks International Golf Course, par three. Well, it's kind of open. Oh, doesn't it look great up here? I don't know why, just green is just the color of relaxation, isn't it? Green, green, moss is green, trees are green. You can just relax. Sometimes the river is green. Oh man, this is gonna be nice. This is a nice, nice, nice upgrade. Really liking it. So, oh, I'm just so happy to be at the finishing line. Kinda like that checkered flag at the finishing line of this whole build. It's been a long time coming. Thank <laughs> you.